This is Catazone, and you're listening to Let's Chop It Up with the boy Trey Boogie, West Coast nigga what? FNG shit. Shot the whole day, go. Shot the bro Trey Boogie. We slide. Huh? Sliding in the rentals, trying to run the milli up. In the southeast, Trey Boogie been a plug. Rubber bands on the blues, hella panoramic views. If you get into it with the squad, you can never lose. Uh, uh. It's on the flow like Yellow Rider. I got your vibe on her toes like nail polish. In the city, we get respected from everybody. You about to pull up on Trey Boogie, now let's chop it. If you talking about the game, let's chop it up. Chop it up. If you talking about the hustle, let's chop it up. Chop it if you talking about the grind, let's chop it up. Talking about some fly vibes, baby, let's chop it up. If you talking about the game, Let's chop it up. If you talking about the hustle, let's chop it up. If you talking about the grind, let's chop it up. Talking about some fly vibes, baby, let's chop it up. Let's chop it up. Got a wet, it's not a cut. Ain't worried about what nobody else got, cause I got enough. Me and Trey Boogie locked in, he threw a lob. I don't hurt to be the sauce it up. Can't nobody go hard as us. If you talking about the game, let's chop it up. If you talking about the hustle, let's chop it up. If you talking about the grind, let's chop it up. Talking about some fly vibes, baby, let's chop it up. If you talking about the game, let's chop it up. If you talk about the hustle, let's chop Trey it up. Boogie, if you talk homies, about the crime, homie. let's chop it up. Talk about some fly vibes, baby, let's chop it up. Hey, we got a, a dope, 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 dope show for you tonight. First of all, I want to thank everybody for tapping in, you know, for 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 sharing, for doing everything y'all do, man. Support, you know, I, I appreciate every last one of you. And today we got a dope show um, I can't wait for the guests to get here and we're going to do our thing. But let me give it out a shout out to all my sponsors. You know, we got Babylon's Garden, Watkins Bell Bonds, Superior Soul Food, SD Elite Sports, J.A. Lumpia and more, Average Joe Burgers. And of course, we got YBNB, Young Black and in Business. And without further ado, I want to introduce my man, Huh, Mr. Roosevelt the Third. He about to give y'all some news you could use. What's up, Roosevelt? Hey, uh, you know what I mean? The big homies, the big homies, man. You know what I mean? Let's chop it up. Let y'all know, uh, you know, young is the state of mind, man. You know, we talk about young black and in business, so we deal with all all uh, ages, man, inclusive. The, the color black encompasses and absorbs every color in the world, man. Every color in the spectrum, man. So it's also inclusive. And uh, the definition of business. Is providing a solution for a problem that makes a profit. That's business right there. So, man, we all young, black, and in business, all inclusive. Look, though, I'm about to give some stock tips because I'm a young EF Hudson. So, you want to get your pen and take these copious notes. And uh, we don't know what tomorrow holds, but we know who holds tomorrow. You know what I mean? So, the unseen and the unknown, that belongs to God, man. So, you know, all the hustlers, all the go getters, you know, all the grinders. Stay encouraged, man. Stay encouraged, man. Keep going, man. Don't give up, man. The word for today is cohesive. Cohesive is the word for today, man. Sticking together, you know, be well integrated, man. Be a unifier, man. Be a team builder. Cohesive. That's the word for today. So, for an example, kings have kingdoms. However, emperors have empires. And empires are built on alliances, man. So, you know, go get you a solid team, man. Foundation, man. Team building. Be cohesive. Unification. Connectivity sustainability. I also wanted to give you another example. Individuals win trophies. Teams win championships. I say it again I say it again for the people that's in the back. Individuals win trophies. Teams win championships. You know, we gotta connect, be cohesive. You know, join the young black and the business nation. You know what I mean? Our community blessing, blessing. Blessing. You know, our community, our city, our people we work better together, you know, teamwork, you know, team up with the best and the brightest, you know what I mean? Your network, your network, team up with the best and the brightest. Our community, our city, and our people work better together. You can't lose with the news that we use. Stay anchored to your family and reach for the stars, man. This is Rose Gold Wins III, President and CEO of Young Black in the Business, and we're going to chop it up again, man. Peace and power. Appreciate you, brother. Appreciate you. That was Rose Gold III, YBNB CEO and founder president everything man he's just ybnb i appreciate you brother all the time they call me yes sir yes sir yes sir again it's your big homies big homie trey boogie and i told y'all we got a dope interview to i got the first <laughs> the first family of san diego right here man 
Curtis and Roxanne McNeil, man. I call them Mr. and Mrs. H. Cole, you know. Uh, they do so much for the town that, you remember I told y'all when I first started doing shows, I need y'all on my show. I want to give you your roses while y'all here. Y'all do things for so many other people just out the kindness of your heart. You did, y'all not a, a 401k or a, what you call it, right? A, a nonprofit. Nah. So everything is coming out of what y'all do. Yeah. Y'all give out awards and y'all everywhere supporting everyone. Y'all, man, the stuff y'all do for Dago, man, I just, if anyone did, and I told you this, yeah. I wanted to be able to interview y'all, man, and, and do <laughs> this, right? And I'm glad it finally was able to happen. Hey, I've been talking for too much, so allow me to introduce the some and present the others, Curtis and Roxanne McNeil. Thank you. Definitely. How y'all doing, man? Definitely, definitely. It's a pleasure. That's it's right. A blessing. All the time, family. I appreciate you. You definitely did. You tapped in with us. Um, and since day one, you've been upfront about what you was doing, mm-hmm. what you're trying to do, mm-hmm. uh, what you're looking to accomplish, and we wanted to be a part of that. Appreciate um, you Introduction wise, my name is Curtis McNeil. This is my wife, and you can definitely uh, yep. uh Roxanne McNeil. Yeah, and I don't know. Watch that be so cool. She's yeah, Roxanne McNeil. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, definitely. And I don't know how it would be if it wasn't for people like you mm. who actually. Um, it ain't even about noticing or or seeing what we do. It's just the fact that you actually just you dive right in. You know, you came to our home. And you did. You told us exactly what you was going to do. And here we are today. So I definitely wanted to, you know, send out a shout out to you, West Coast Radio, all those tuning in, timing in. Yeah, we had a busy day today, but yeah. definitely uh, I want to give it to my wife. Um, if what you're looking for is an introduction. And, That's it. Uh, we can start that with that. Hey, well, you know who I am. I said my <laughs> name. Um, I also go by Della Queen. Uh, That's my artist name. My middle name was Della, and so I've been using that for uh, poetry, and it's actually the name of our business. So everything is under Della Queen, um, the business, um, and as the umbrella. And it's just just a lot. There's a lot that we want to do, a lot more that we want to do. But I wanted to um, go back and also say um, you were always um, supporting um, not just us, but a lot of people in the town, you know, from behind the scenes before you started your... um, your own interviews and um, just we we noticed we appreciate um, your presence and Thank you. Um, definitely um, for myself um, uh, we've been married for uh, about a decade now and uh, it was old a, love it's been it's <laughs> been a beautiful journey uh, we have so many things that like this one I wanted to release um, love letters which were our letters um, back and forth um, before we actually um, you know physically yeah you okay physically with that were together. Yeah, um, you want to oh, see yeah. that side of you, I'm, right? I'm okay with where you was. Uh, it was at your loneliest. <laughs> it was actually very educational. That's why I wanted to put it out there. You yeah, know? that's right. Like the, the real love story, Romeo yeah, and genuine, yeah. Yeah. yeah, ghetto Romeo, definitely black cut, yeah, yeah. brown, yeah. But um, other than that, um, before uh, he came home, I've been doing a lot uh, with my life. I don't know how much of an introduction or story you want, but... Um, well, you are doing a lot with your life. I mean, we could... I wanted to dive in, you know, about your, your books and the stuff yeah. you got going on, but, you know, go at it. Let them know. Let them know. She's, a, she's well, acting shy right now. No, I'm, I yeah, don't. Let them know. I don't want to, you know, I know we we'll have time. We'll get back to Curtis in a minute. Uh, Ladies can, first. I, Ladies I, first. I, you see what I did. I actually <laughs> handed it over. Yeah. You I, did, you did oh, pass the baton. Um, I'm definitely I'm kind of going that. backwards. Um, it's from, all good. From when we, we met. But, um, yeah, going way back, um, since you talk about poetry, uh, we were cleaning out a warehouse after my mom passed, and we seen a. Uh, he brought home, actually, a box of um, my stuff from childhood. Mm. So, you know, little pictures. You know, I always seemed like I, I showed the sunny side of life um, at that point, and uh, just poetry then. So I was like, oh, yeah, I did like poetry. So maybe now, finally, in my golden years, which I wrote a poem called uh, Golden Days, Okay, um, that was um, maybe, you know, what I always had a passion to do. So... Uh, Anyway, I, it kind of um, kind of gave me a um, idea that I was back on the right track when I started writing. Mm. I actually picked up um, and started writing um, a lot more aggressively when uh, I met Curtis. I got inspired again, and I wrote um, Love Chronicles Part One and Part Two. He blushing. 
And then, uh, you know, it just, just brought me around to um, thinking about after I retire from education, which I retired, but I'm still teaching, but um, I can get to that in a minute. But um, I definitely um, started writing again, and, mm. and it was for almost a decade now. I have um, quite a bit um, compiled, and yes, um, looking forward to releasing at least a book or two this year. Okay. Um, first one's going to call um, A Heart Revealed, and the second one would be um, Broken Wings Still Fly. So those two, and then the third what one. What about the cooking book? Well, that's that's what I'm waiting yeah. for. I want to try some. Food. I will. Like, I, I will work on that. I just said yesterday, I'm tired of eating Please chicken, get her. Get her. Get her. You know, they the same things every day. Get I want to try something. Since you different. asked, I'm going to work on that. I really will because, of course, I've been. I cooking. wish I knew which button was for the hand clap. You know, oh, I think. There you go. That's oh, right there. damn. Yeah. Yeah. Everything. She's definitely being modest. Um, the cookbook, she even stopped at that. I mean, I've actually uh, dishes, written a couple, but they just never. Recipes. I want to try the chili. There you go. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Okay. Tell All I chili. hear about is the chili. Tell them oh, about the chili. chili brings people together. Mm-hmm. <laughs> the chili that brings people together. Yeah. yeah, they don't know what kind of meat it is, but it's not really meat. It's just it's vegan stuff, stuff, right? Yeah, yeah I mean, vegan. It's tofu or vegan. what is it? It's a bunch of stuff. It's it's um it's some soy. Um, I use um, a lot of veggies. Um just, it just it just seems uh, eat soy burgers. You just and, have to know stuff. how to season stuff. It's Not all beef. in the seasoning. Okay, yeah, yeah. It definitely yeah. Definitely yeah. and the cooking, but definitely the seasoning. So I want some of that chili. Okay, next Not time problem. y'all do it. Come on now, definitely. Oh, you we'll know do you're it. welcome yeah. anytime. That's definitely it's, all we, the, we do all for the chili. guests. Yeah, We're most of our chili. guests know about it. That you know came to the compound. That's right. Uh, they've actually indulged in the uh, is the chili because it's the nachos, it's the fries, it's the chili with the, the nachos, nachos it's too. The chili, right? Chili I'm, nacho, I'm, I'm, chili I'm, cheese, I'm, nachos. Hello. With no I'm meat. I'm trying to get a, Yeah, I'm trying to see what cheese, it is. The fries. It's, I'm yeah, thinking this week. Yeah, yeah, we'll have to. We'll have to get on it. This I'll have to do it this week. Yeah. yeah. Y'all it's that heard time. it. It's that time. Y'all heard it. There you go. Um, Curtis, let them know about you real quick, right? Well, about me is just definitely in a nutshell, just someone that um. It's not that's sugarcoat looking, nothing. Yeah, Let's tell them just, who you are and that's just someone and that then came go into there you go. That what just drives came, you yeah. into doing what you someone do. Someone that just trying to you. basically, in a nutshell, come out of what he started. Mm-hmm. Um I've been away for a while in prison, away from society, uh over a decade. And sometimes we start a journey and in that journey we actually have to fulfill that journey. And mm-hmm. you know, in the beginnings uh, Chicago, that's where I'm originally from. Shot uh, town. Yeah, the go. Yeah, but uh been out here since five years old, 1984. Mm-hmm. Um, my grandma moved out here on respects to the murders that were happening out there and, mm-hmm. and, and change that she wanted for her children. A lot mm-hmm. of murders have mm-hmm. been taking place in my family. That's how a lot so, of us There you go. Yeah. Here, so. so she actually wanted to know what it would be like to actually survive and have the kids successful in, in, in their pursuits or whatever. So she moved out here. Uh, San Diego Spring Valley. So been familiar with San Diego for years and uh, definitely um, got familiar with prison um, at a young age, 17. So went in at 17 mm. to 18. Um, and most of the facilities she, she teach at and, and taught at, um, I've been. So I even came back to even mentor and um, 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 share my story as well with that. So, but yeah, being away from society, I, I started to study, um, I've been in the music business since 1994. Uh, we, we we had a label going. We had singles going, so music is familiar, too. Mm. But studying. Um, the, uh, shout out to the brother that was just on. Um, definitely, um, his lyrics was pretty much intact. Like, Rick definitely, Scales. Yeah, Rick, Big up yeah, Rick definitely. Scales. Man. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And um, that's what I, I got to doing after my study, and I started breaking down the way I was writing my mm. music and, and the routes that I was going at and making that money, you know, concerning the music. So... Um, in a nutshell, I actually started to change from within. And after I started to see things for what they were and what my grandma envisioned, that's where I came up with the theory. I'm a grandma's there baby, too. Grandma right. had it all right. And um, started writing the album. And from that point, I just flourished into basically just wanting to get home and make a difference. So in that, um, came home and started this business with my wife, uh, like I said, in the beginning, it's through her that I actually, you know, I do flourish because 
sometimes we need to take a step back. Sometimes we need to actually see things from a different perspective. Yeah. And um, it's not always a woman's perspective or a homie's perspective or a family's per- It's just another perspective. Mm-hmm. Um, and hopefully it's someone you respect um, because that, that, you know, weighs heavy on, on your thoughts and, you know, dreams as well. But, um, yeah, Della Queen and um, definitely um, is where I look to pursue uh, my music and the development that I believe, mm. you know, a, 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 um, attracted me while I was away. Okay. So no cussing uh, in my music. Uh, since, yeah, uh, I, I like that about there you. you go. Yeah. I know some pe- other people who do that yeah. and focus on but that. No, and not, I nothing against that. it. Yeah, nothing against it or nothing. And, and, but, and you know what a lot of uh, honorable yeah. Elijah Muhammad said? Yeah. A no, person well, cuss yeah. because they don't they don't know any wise words to use. Well, that's how it happened. It happened you know? while in prison. So I used to do rap battles in prison. Mm-hmm. Um, I used to do shows. I even got flyers still. It's back hard for me school. to yeah. freestyle without there cussing. You go. That's how it started. I can't freestyle without cussing, yeah. and I'd be trying. You know, that's why I don't freestyle because <laughs> I'm a cuss. Nah, nah, yeah, yeah. So I that's how I started. You know, I try not to cuss. Mm-hmm. Yeah, it started like that. I used to challenge. I used to challenge artists to freestyle without cussing. Uh, we used to do prizes and have pots put in and stuff like that. And uh, so that's how it actually, you know, grew from there. And okay. then started writing albums and all that. But I still, like I said, um, I still talk about the things that you know are raw and, and an experience. But exactly, I found words to actually replace. And it was, it was it was something on my grandmother wished upon me. And my uh, my family to actually, yeah. she said, like, you could tell your story, but why do you got to, and why do you got to. Especially and, during our yeah, time. Yeah. When, yeah. like, NWA, there you go. calling yeah. people bees and the <laughs> N-word. Yeah. You know, but the, it's a different era. Yeah. And yeah. So, you know, coming home, um, I came home and pretty much wanted to actually push that that particular product. And that's how I came up with the magazine. Uh, we ran a club for uh, you have a few, a few magazines. There, yeah, Let them know about all the magazines yeah. y'all have. Yeah, you know, definitely. Well, initially, too many yeah. I couldn't remember all of them <laughs> no. off the top of the head. <laughs> yeah. I, and yeah. I left my paper. I ain't going to lie. Yeah. I left the paper at home. Yeah. Yeah. Like, it was three pages of all the magazines y'all got, like, like. <laughs> Yeah, so it started humbly. Yeah, no, nah, it, it started humbly at the club. We was running um, Today's Rapper magazine was, a, you know, shout out to my brother Ron, uh, my publisher, late publisher who passed. Mm. And um, definitely, uh, Today's Rapper magazine, uh, we came out with that first to definitely San Diego has, shout out to San Diego artists, the rap artists, the hip hop scene out here. Um, I've. I've I've met countless artists out here and Denver. and and I love San Diego artists and they all bring their own flavor. It's it's it's, it's bigger than a gumbo, mm. but it's just as flavorful. Mm. It's just it's it's so it's so vast and it's and bigger it's than a gumbo, versatile. but just as flavorful. I like that. <laughs> it, it's, it's look at them dropping knowledge, but no, but look for real though. That's so knowledge. Today's rapper magazine is 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 where I came. Like I said, I've been gone. I've been mm-hmm. gone for a while. So like what we say with the cussing, that's personal. But I respect those who are out here pushing their product. I respect artists that are out here uh, grinding because mm-hmm. regardless of how they're doing it, they're putting themselves out there to uh, to get noticed or to putting themselves out there. To get chastised. Go, or to chastise, exactly. Mm-hmm. And you got to take a couple of lashings. Mm-hmm. So today's Rapper Magazine came because me not wanting to take away from today and those artists that are out here, even though I've been gone. Mm-hmm. Some of us actually come in, even though it's OGs, we come and we try to change and we try to dictate today. Right. And if we learned anything, we know we can't dictate today, let alone tomorrow. So I gave the respect of today's rapper, and that's what I did. I dove right in with my wife, shout out my partner, and we opened the club. And that's what we did under the, the publishing and today's rapper to, okay. to put ourselves out there, um, pretty much grassroot this particular journey in the publishing game. So mm. today's rapper is one. And shout out to all the artists that have been featured. Shout out to uh, San Diego music scene who uh, embraced us uh, yeah. gracefully. Yeah, they, they definitely um, embraced us. Then we have um, uh, Music Life magazine. Mm. So Music Life magazine is, is a, it's a multi-genre uh, uh, magazine, and she can um, definitely delve off into that part. Multicultural, meaning that we wanted to feature not just um, today's rappers. We wanted to feature other artists, other genres, um, and other lifestyles. Rock, That's why it's a multicultural genre. That's right. So it gives uh, it gives even uh, producers, business uh, men, anybody who's um, you know they're doing something. And definitely, um, we we try to focus on um, doing something for others. 
So, you know, in their business, they're um, serving or um, what have you. Um, so that was kind of how we got into um, music life. Nice. And that's what y'all do. Y'all do, like, take care of, you know, y'all y'all support, y'all, y'all acknowledge, you give recognition to, mm-hmm. like, you know, before we really just knew each other, I seen y'all doing y'all thing. I was like, man, these people are like, I mean, you know what I mean? Like, who does that? Right. You know what I mean? Like, there's only so many type of people who do that type of stuff. At least more people are doing it and now. And it's out that of your was, heart. Yeah. yeah. Mm-hmm. And that's where the love is. That's why I was like, yo, when we yeah, finally met, I was like, yo, yeah. I've been watching you, man. Y'all mm-hmm. doing y'all thing. And, um, you know, you, you, you touched on something. Well, I want to. We're going to talk about some things because, you know, being a brother that yeah. did some time, I'm hooked up. You remember the Lifers group? There you go. Yeah, definitely. Maxwell Melvin. Uh, we're going to plug you up. We're going to be doing some seminars. Oh, yeah. You know, we all done time. We all this and yeah. that. And now what we're doing now and you a motivational speaker, you know, an artist. Uh, how how do y'all get all them daggone animals, man? Like you a black man. <laughs> And you got pigs and little miniature horses, and now y'all got Cap uh, um, Curtis. It's called right. Yeah, yeah Cap like y'all Curtis. got. Tur- oh yeah, be on the there, definitely. Yeah, baby dinosaurs. Y'all got all kind of stuff at your house, man. How did that happen, bro? <laughs> That's what I want to know. And that'll be the first uh, non- sc- nonprofit I talk about <laughs> because you go. There you go. we right want there. to definitely. That um, is yeah. a- we, there it is. It's we big, say, and like what you yeah, said, literally, I'll be yeah, so far gone. Time. Yeah, that's tight. I'd be seeing the pictures, and it's the yeah. I'm waiting to bring ours. Go. Yeah, I told her about it. You know, I would we gonna bring the kids over there to see the little yeah. miniature horses and there stuff. Yeah. That's where I want to see the little tiny horses, well, like right? yeah, because that's what it was about uh, back in the day. Um, you Where rarely you seen that. Yeah, you, you really seen that. You gotta, you gotta, you really do gotta <laughs> hey. open yourself up to actually. You gotta open yourself up. To actually receive, you do. Um, the creator is real. The universe is real. Spirit is real. Flesh is even real. All these things really do match up once you play your cards right. Um, and it just was. It, it started off as a thought. And every time I, I <laughs> what do you do? Go get one little look, miniature look, horse. Look, look. No, and then you no, bring she'll tell home you that. Look, no, no, no. He wrote a song stand. about that too. Called no. Baby, and then she knows. You bring home a pig. <laughs> look, like no, how do no, that happen? No, as no, a black she'll man. tell you that. I yeah. mean, I know it's we coming. should grow no, our look, food look, a day. Tell them, tell them, yeah. So, so he would say something, or he'd say, "I had a dream," and um, la la la. And so uh, he would say something about <laughs> animals, and I know he was an animal lover. So I'm kind of like, after having my five kids and some animals, I was kind of like, oh, animals. But he loves animals, so okay. He'd mention something, and I'd say, oh, he kind of want a couple pigs, huh, or a couple goats. He, he would say a couple pigs or a couple goats, and he had Always a dream. Always a couple, too. It two, has to like be two. The, two of each. A man and a, 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 yeah, a male and a female. It has so, to be two. It, 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 it ain't Pairs. just always two, because that's going to turn into 58. Well, that's when it that's does. When Multiply it does. and be but, fruitful. But, you know, the life is alive on the compound. <laughs> it's flourishing. Go. So, no, nah, it started And it's off. a beautiful thing. Yeah. It there is real go. beautiful. Yeah. I mean, look it up like, oh, man. I mean, you know, that is that is cool. You know what I mean? And y'all... I, look, y'all in the hood. Y'all <laughs> yeah, right yeah, there yeah, in the yeah, valley, yeah, you know yeah. what I mean? And have a whole <laughs> animal thing right there going on. You wouldn't even know it, you know yeah, what I mean? Know. Well, no, I got That's the kids. I, I, the kids, like I said, I definitely, you know, I chime in. That's how <laughs> that Cam Curtis, tight. yeah, it, it came out. But, yeah, no, nah, I'm a, so I'm a visionary. Come. And, no, nah, I'm, I'm a guy that actually, it, once it comes, I do. I like to set goals and, Don't tell you know, me because it's going to happen. So yeah, it, many, it'll come after that. How many animals y'all have, like? Oh, all together? Um, like, what like, a what, what a what. We have, like, ten pigs, and we have, like, five goats. They all we got have, names, too. They got names. Uh, now we have exactly a couple cats. Are. We have a few reptiles. Um, we have chickens, of course. And Don't forget the little I miniature roosted. horses. Those are ponies. That's correct. So what are they called? They're, like, half the size of a horse. They're ponies. So these That's are, what a these pony are ponies. Is. So they look like I a, thought they were a they pony was something like different than a miniature horse. horse. They have miniature they horses too. Right. They, That's what the, I thought those were. The, there are miniature ones, but we have ponies, which yeah, are uh-huh. kind original. of original ponies. A little smaller than a donkey. Well, just yeah. about. Yeah. Just about. 
I just learned that last yeah. week. Yeah, just about. So you have they, a, you'll, they, have they to, come up, you'll have to see uh, him when you see him. it. No, oh, some you will. Uh, when you guys yeah, from, come have from chili, distance, you'll have yeah. to see him. Oh, yeah, I definitely yeah, will. Yeah, so, and Luna. so he would mention. Shiloh and Luna. Okay. Luna. He would mention something, <laughs> and then all of a sudden, I would see it. It would come, or or uh, the goats came because my son said, weren't you guys thinking about goats? And he said, somebody has two girls, and they can't keep them. So I said, Let me, let's go check them out. So we go check them out, and they ended up in our yard. And each one of the animals was a journey in itself. Yeah. Um, their stories. Oh. Um, when we got the, when we got the goats. We got the night we got the goats was crazy. So we tried to tie them outside first, and we put them uh, down there in it by a tree. And they started like they sound like sheep's kind of thing. Meh. Meh. They just cry. Meh. We're like, oh man, we can't be having this like in the middle of the night. Yeah. So you know, he brings them in. So. I'd have been mad. The goats come in. Yeah. It's it's like there's yeah, so many. Goat. We could write books on the stories nah, yeah. about. No, it these is animals. Camp Curtis. I think it should yeah, be that's a, cool, a, a little short story on like yeah. definitely, but cartoon, it'll be funny. But no, it'll be no, it story. will be funny Ooh, that's because we're yeah, at cartoon. the part now where they're yeah, all like, like kids. they're all tamed and all that. But no, it was buck wild. Have you it seen you on the videos walking them and stuff? Yeah, I have a funny story lately. That is so cool. So there's one of one of the horses is we found out is um kind of blind and going blind so mm. we're like dang and he's only four years old but in the mornings you'll hear him out there you know do that baby <laughs> and then he'll say there Jungle. goes there goes wilbur how are you doing and i go wilbur <laughs> yeah there you go he does it better so he says there goes wilbur and i was like damn wilbur that's wilbur that's somebody with a horse uh, the, the, mr the horse, ed uh, mr ed or I thought, but it was the owner and I, he kept saying wilbur and i was like dang i know that name wilbur and then i realized he was talking about the guy but anyway that's another side story. <laughs> yeah. So yeah, nah, I'm an animal lover. She really isn't like. Well, I like, I love well, him now. I mean, yeah, really he isn't. Takes so care it's, of it's, him as long as he it's definitely. Uh, I do take that pressure off of her pretty much, um, um, to the degree, of course. But uh, yeah, I, I, I have fun. It's it's fun. Um, they love him. Uh, Did you have a sheet with a whole him. bunch of hair or something? Uh, uh, and y'all had to shave it. Oh, did I see that somewhere, somewhere else? else. I just we, all of ours have that hair. Only the animals. Yeah. Not nah, the it ponies. They just got trims. They oh, okay. Little, little bag. Yeah, y'all do it. Just get a little. <laughs> yeah, she, she she does eyes. Little, yeah, boom. She just does a little. <laughs> let's shout. You got Bosses Magazine too, yeah. right? Oh yeah. Oh, yeah. yeah. So yeah, Bosses. Go people well, first. People yeah, came before Bosses. That's what I'm about to say. Yeah. So no, definitely. Yeah, but yeah. That's that Camp Curtis, but uh, yeah, San Diego People Magazine um, is another one. San Diego People, yeah, San that's Diego better. People, yes, magazine. So that's just representing or, or acknowledging. We've my done, people. we've we've been mm-hmm. in numerous community events. We've been a part of many festivals um, and a lot of activists that's been out here. How many uh, awards people. have y'all got from the town? <laughs> Personally, <laughs> personally, we've got how many? A couple. We've gotten a couple, couple. like from real from, legit. From, Places. Yeah. Well, um, that, well, let me let me say. Not like me giving no, no, you no. awards. Like, let's, yeah. Let's you know I mean? back because up. Because the stuff you guys do. Let's back up because the incredible. only awards was really started from the um, Diamond Street Festival. You know, certificates of um, because we did, we did yeah, the we've entertainment, done entertainment and all that. So that was in the last few years. But um, and then other organizations that once we were giving out awards, they were giving out awards, and we did uh, get an award. Uh, Okay. Someone, but not really. We don't yeah. really. Because it's like, like I said from the beginning, well, it's well, about giving people their we never, roses. Well, for me, for me, uh, you guys work yeah. tirelessly. For me, you be uh, in the morning till night. Our reward, like, you be like literally. fifteen different places in one yeah, day. Literally, yeah. Our interviews, reward is just, even though, it's yeah. amazing. Yeah. Well, the just reward we is yeah, is doing is being. It's 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 the actual fact of yeah, uh, being able to do it. Yeah. Um, I get I get a kick out of it. It seems mm-hmm. like I get younger by the day. Um, love is I get healthier beautiful. by the day. Say that. The welcome, um, the welcome that I get from the people, that's my award. Uh, the love, the, uh, the love, like the, genuine. Yeah, you know, like um, the social media and mm-hmm. the the recognition that and we did it, and that was the point. People didn't even know they were getting recognition. Right. Most of the people we gave awards, they were shocked. They were like, or like, hey, I, who don't want an award? I there mean, you go. <laughs> the people we see, I may after. go buy me hey, one tomorrow. There you go, look, got him, <laughs> but nah, but yeah. So nah, the reason we started, and <laughs> she, myself she says the same thing though. She actually, 
she she gets into this conversation when we chop it up on our own and she brings up topics like that, certain things and mm-hmm. and and um you know, my thing is like I don't get into that. I don't do what I do for right. um recognition or Money, uh, our, our 4-year-old it, it grandson he had a choice of all these gifts in a big uh, box, and his mom was kind of like, look at that one. He wanted the little gold plastic trophy. He wanted that trophy, and he was so happy with that trophy. So it just made me think, of, you know what I mean, what you said. But, yeah. Uh, it's, yeah. It's, it's. Nah, yeah. I, it's I'm, I'm someone that's totally different. And then, like, you know, my path and coming from where I came from, um, just being home was my award. Um, Having being that able second to, chance. No, it's still the third, first. Fourth. Nah, it's still the, I don't know about a second or a third. Okay, this is, I had it's a been whole one. bunch of different yeah. chances. Oh no, nah, this has been a long journey. It was it was long. It was long and gruesome, dark and mm-hmm. cold. Yeah, but uh, nah, it was light at the end of that tunnel. Mm-hmm. Um, and that's what you see. Mm-hmm. You see someone advocating. Like I said, the universe is real. The spirit is real. Mm-hmm. The creator is real. Hello, um, and. Our choices are real. Mm. And everything that I chose, and like I tell her, I tell her to make sure before she starts her day that she understands that this is my award. Okay. Um, even when, like I said, the animals, that's what I am. I'm able to make jokes about it because it's not that I asked for it. It's more so like, wow, dreams do come true. I saw it and it came to fruitation. Dreams do Is that what it's called? Fruita- fruition. fruition. Yeah, that's okay. Yeah, I always yeah. say fruitation. Yeah. That's okay. You made it your word. You can do that. I, I like that word. That's fruitation. poetry. You, you can make up your own words. It was uh, poetry. Yeah. But yeah, so now nah, speaking of the, um, the other magazines, so uh, yeah, uh, San Diego People <laughs> magazine was, was off of that. We've been, you know, pretty much uh, in the streets, literally supporting, helping, providing sound, entertainment uh, for numerous organizations. Mm-hmm. Uh, People and like what she mentioned, the Diamond District actually hired us for uh, exclusively for entertainment for a couple of years. Uh, wow. One of the biggest festivals since, uh, you know, the Encanto Street Fair. And That's we actually record. got to do the uh, uh, do that on in, uh, on Imperial, too. And it reminded me because I used to go there with my grandmother mm. uh, back in the day. So, um, but yeah, um, uh, the Bosses Magazine came. Shout out to my boy, Rich. Um yeah, uh, he's been on me about that for a couple of years now. Um, Big ups to, yeah. to Rich. Yes, <laughs> uh, yes, definitely. I've been knowing Rich for over. Uh, hey, yeah, I, I know y'all so, know. Yeah. So, but uh, yeah, but uh, yeah, it came. We was uh, definitely in in the play of, of of doing it. And the Soul Swap Me once again, we advocate like anything that's happening. Like I said, with the community events and anything that we've done, we throw ourselves literally out there tell them about the bosses yeah. and then tell them about the magazine and then tell them about the soul swap me there you go i used because to that's what i was saying the soul swap me was the beneficiary i feel is because the bosses magazine is entrepreneurs it's not just black it's entrepreneurs uh i was featured there you go yes and I yes brought, yeah. i was featured y'all yes and the third page <laughs> yes sir but yeah page no, three we appreciate that you already uh, know oh, i appreciate and, that. and that's how we did it tapped in what you wear you was at the soul swami so it's just inner you know inner intertwined kind of like but no it's definitely to acknowledge and now we're at a directory mm. so the website is up and going uh we're looking to establish the 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 whole uh opening of the website soon but okay. no it's 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 for entrepreneurs and it's basically to find uh, like people don't know what businesses are accessible uh, what type of businesses are out there uh, for the community black community any community uh, what i respect about the bosses magazine is that it once again it's not about us it's, like any it's inclusive it's, it's not there you exclusive go. there you Everybody. go and anybody and everybody that has a product service as yeah. it should be product mm-hmm. service um um is uh definitely welcome and um, that's what we, we look at it as. And that's what it actually, you know, deems fit. You know, and that, that kind of is the same with the awards. When you go back to the awards, if you looked at um, the breakfasts and how many awards were given out around Martin Luther King Day, um, you see that it was only a couple really big places that they gave awards. And people that got awards were generally um, heads of organizations that were either governmental or they were being funded. So right. all the people right. that were putting in grassroots or on the ground – we're, we're not getting recognition. It, it rolls it was, downhill. So right. the one up here it's, is getting the props and the people down here and, put in the work. That was part of the reason, not, too, yeah. that we wanted to say, hey, 
you know, these people are like whew, the little men. They need, yeah, they need to know that. that we see them and thank you for your service. And that was kind of the same thing with the directory, where it's you know, like you said, all inclusive. Um, and then that's for people to choose to be in, you know, not Very to cool. be in. But the other one, it's hard because so many people you can't recognize. You know, started out with we had like four awardees the first year. Yeah. The next year, maybe I don't know, oh, yeah. it, it went up to six or eight. And like, then I was giving them it was out like every hundreds day or something. Like, man, it was, nah, the years <laughs> were going every year, and we didn't want to Everybody downplay. I see y'all, y'all I'm like man, they be working. <laughs> I do yeah. shows three days a week now. You <laughs> dig? It started off once, now yeah, it's three, yeah, yeah, yeah. and I be tired. Yeah, yeah. Y'all be here, and then, there, and then you're 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 here. Like, man, like people like y'all. It's like, like you know, and, and y'all see it? Look at they shirts, y'all. Oh, that's what I'm talking about, man. That, that's, hey. that's when you know it's love right there, man. Yeah. When y'all walk out in the same outfit, you dig? Same kinds of socks on. And that, that's hard, All too, that. because some people don't, hey, don't nah, care yeah. for that. Nah, they be yeah. like, baby. I get they, the they, about that. Yeah, they be like, hey, hey, they, hey let them hate. Yeah. Baby, when we going to get ours? And he'd be like, why you do that? Why yeah. you wearing that, that stuff together? Yeah. Don't need to no, they don't got the Rayon shirts on, y'all. Hey, look. JW Chess Keys. Yeah, nah, yeah, definitely, yeah. Give me a chest key. There man. you go. Got I it. used to get my uh my my, my rayons and my Remember cavarichis. Those? Yeah, nah, yeah. You don't know about no cavarichis, yeah. Ray. The slacks, yeah. the fancy slack truck. Okay. They oh, were yeah. fancy. Well, no, nah, they were. Some yeah. chess keys, okay, fancy. I- Forty dollar right. pan. That's you know, so that nice. was fancy. That was back with the dom. That yeah, is fancy. that was fancy. Cavarichis were fancy back then. Hey, I, man, I, you know. We could sit here and talk and talk and <laughs> yeah. talk and talk, what but else? I it's know. About you. It's about you, too, because that's the part. You know, I'm just mm-hmm. doing what I do. This is what I do. I live, I sleep, I dream, and I find a way to combine. You know what I mean? So, Y'all motivate me. Like, yeah. you know, I reached out, like, I started my shirts. I reached out to Boston and my little brothers, Boston Shout and out, Mark yeah. Bell. Um, Shout out. And they gained me. They, You know what I mean? We. I told you what I was thinking about doing. You know what I mean? I knew you guys, you know, but you could never have too many outlets. There you go. Enough. Yeah. I'm trying to bring Dago up. Nah, yeah. So the more outlets, artists, mm-hmm. business owners, mm-hmm. politicians, um, mm-hmm. community activists, the more outlets they have, it's better for them. Yeah. So I, 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 Man, I want 50,000 more people to start doing podcasts mm-hmm. and shows and stuff. There you go. You welcome it. Right? Our artists yeah. need somewhere else to go. There you That's go. That's true. So it's a beautiful thing. And everything you guys do, man, it's like, I keep saying, it's, it's just really from the heart. Like, y'all yeah. are just, like, for real. Like, they go royalty, man. You dig? And I really appreciate everything y'all do and continue to do. And uh-huh. we'll continue to do. Oh, yeah. For the town, man. Mm-hmm. You know, any last shots? You know, this is your point right here. Both of y'all give shout outs. Yeah. Give whatever you want to give, man. It's your, it's your moment right here. Shout out to, first of all, just like tonight, all the artists working so hard, um, you know, to get their work, work out and their craft. Um, you know, shout out. Shout out to... To you, to everybody, like, say, doing things and, um, you know, working with and around others and for others. Um, shout out to um, my baby right here. Oh. Shout out to all the hard work. He's a hardworking man. This is not February. He's up, he's up oh, before, this is he's up before the dawn. <laughs> the dawn isn't when the light breaks. The dawn is the darkest time before the light breaks. He's up. You know, <laughs> making right. sure the animals yeah. don't sound off. So he's <laughs> feeding. <laughs> no. I didn't mean to hit that. No, I yeah. thought they were coming. <laughs> like, yeah. I know no. we down here. We, I'm like, y'all part is over. Y'all yeah, talking hey, too sweet. Hey, man, that's too over. That Someone part is over. Call 911. Hey, that part is <laughs> over. Right? Yeah. But yeah, shout out to everybody in Dago. I just, from, really? like I said, uh, the, all the magazines represents all the entities. Um, there's, there's so many that actually uh, play a part in this this rotation um, and these daily grinds and, like you say, motivation and that motivate me. You motivate me. Mm-hmm. Um, shout out to West Coast Radio. Shout out to Trey mm-hmm. Boog. He, he definitely came to our home and 
once again told us what he wanted to do. And that's all we've been seeing and witnessing is him doing that. And um, that's what motivates me. Um, people who, you know, come back to be able to chop it up. I see chop it up as something after attaining, obtaining. Um, it's something that just, you know, that I felt like we needed to be a part of. And we plan on being and more a part of or involved. Let's uh, do it. Definitely. Let's work. Yeah. Let's work. Um, I've been saying yeah, it for a minute. Yeah, Let's work. Yeah. And this was the introduction. Yeah. And we appreciate you. And so we y'all appreciate it. Yeah. Y'all like it. I mean, you know, yeah, I try I to do yeah. something in no. the live performances and all oh, that. Oh, yeah, definitely. Yeah. No, you don't tap it in. You know? There you go. Yeah. Let's Chop so. It Up is being played in uh, Chicago, Jersey, oh, yeah. Canada, Sweet. and in Dago. So, I mean... I'm just thankful, man. Like, people believe in me. People like what I'm doing. You know, I hear mm-hmm. artists from other places like, man, I appreciate you, Trey Boogie, for doing this. It's like, I just felt like COVID <laughs> okay. messed up things for artists. I had a whole bunch yeah. of stuff planned in 2020. Ooh. Like, 2020 was going to be the year. And then COVID hit. Mm-hmm. You know, but nah, it just helped people become better versions of themselves if you did mm-hmm. it right. There you go. Some people, you know, went that the other way. Problems. But Shit. other people sat down, learned, studied, um, figured out who they were and what they are trying to do and came out a better version of themselves. And it's just a beautiful thing, you know. Again, I appreciate you guys, like, you <clears> know, <throat> Y'all like uncle and auntie. <laughs> and you probably only, I might be older than you. I don't know, but we ain't going to talk about that online. But, yeah. You know, I may be older than you. Oh, you what? Uh, but you, nah, yeah. uh, you got that. I'm yeah. 49, man. You got that. I'm 49. Yeah. How old do I look? <laughs> and that's going to be the show for the night, <laughs> y'all. <laughs> hey, how old do I look? And you know black don't crack. There you go. Unless you smoke it. That's oh, it. Yeah, okay, look at that. Yeah. Hello, somebody. One time. <laughs> hey. Again. But yeah. Hello. Tell him. Yes, sir. But yeah, 41, man. I'm 41. Okay. Okay. Dang. Yeah. <laughs> so you can't be awkward, nigga. You say, uh, don't be a, a menace yourself. What's the movie? <laughs> when the stepdad was like 10 years younger Filming? than the son. <laughs> uh, yeah. uh, 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 what was it? What the way is? Yeah. Yeah. That was crazy, dude. It was still in high school. <laughs> Yeah, that was bananas. He was still in high school and stuff. But uh, yeah, man. Oh yeah, yeah. But yeah, appreciate it. I love y'all, man. man. And I appreciate y'all. Likewise. You know. Oh, can I? Thanks for having us. Do what you gotta do. Oh yeah, yeah. I need the. I need one of them shirts. Oh Oh, yeah, got him. (laughs) Yeah. Check me out though. Check me out. Every day I gain picture for a frame. Open me a book, exercise within my brain. We shouldn't be so personal. I'm stalling out my time. Today's a rapper magazine. Catch me on my grind. Today's association lead to affirmations. Incarcerations was adolescence turning into blessing. Material retraction. Distracted from position. My homie struggled to picture life without using pistols. Mm. On top of it, we're using Facebook for serving issues. Mm. Much is really miss you. Mom, I really miss you. On top of that, I pray to the heavens about these issues. I didn't mean to diss you. Please unload the pistol. Mm. Shout out. West Coast mm, Radio. Mm, mm. <laughs> I had to get it right. Shout out, hey, though. Nah, thank you, that's though, man. That's bars and, right and there, man. That's music. bars. H. Cole Music coming. Uh, M1, that's my artist name. Della Queen. We got a compilation coming out. Uh, we're going to get into our music. That's what What do M1 for. mean? <laughs> Let them know. Hey, well, it stood for Murder One, and now it's Mysterious One. So. Okay. Yeah, that's the second coming. So the second coming isn't it's the mysterious. journey. It's the re yeah, definitely. The rebirth. There you go. Yeah, there you go. Yeah. See that's see, look, you be thinking ahead of the game. You know what I mean? <laughs> and, yeah. and and our our genre is rap, but it's a go. new it's rap. Called, it's yeah. respectful and respectful poetic. Respectful and poetic. So it's our new genre. Conscious rap. rap. You know me, yeah. yeah. Kind of like yeah. conscious yeah. rap, kinda bringing like conscious, conscious rap yeah. back. You know, there when you, you didn't have to call somebody all out there their name just to there, get your point across. That's what I love, man. Hey, nice. And that's what my people all over that mess with me love. Oh, yeah. We love that boom bap. We oh, love yeah. that original hip hop. Oh, yeah. I'm sorry, y'all. I don't do the purse 
fingernail, skinny jean rapping music. I don't even, you know, little there aspirin. But well, that's what it does. The Today's Rapper magazine, on, that's on, what one of my, my focal questions in the whole interview, I let them go into their whole story. But in winding it, I asked them a neutral question, which is the whole point. What does today's rapper mean to you? You do that. That's the big question. They be it stuck. Is. They be saying some weird stuff go, sometimes but, too. There you go. But I can't. It's so a some neutral people question. be saying but some weird what things because they but don't. They don't go. understand what you're there asking you them. But the whole point is the whole point is to get that. It's not to expose it, but to actually get that particular perspective and today's to have rapper. it. Be, yeah. What is today's rapper? And but mm-hmm. most most actually say it though. Mm-hmm. Most actually say, man, like what you saying. The new age ain't today's rappers ain't nothing. They can't even really rap. They only saying two bars and repeating the and hook a whole fifteen bunch times. Of but yeah, there you go. Repeating the hook fifteen times of ad libs in between. So, but that's what it is to actually get that. That design. Oh I'm yeah, about to come out with, with oh yeah, with the whole microphones. Yeah. Very nice. Yeah. Oh, yeah, that's nice. You know, I got the long live hip hop. There you go. Right. Yeah, that's so one of the first ones. What I was going to do out. was yeah. something like this and do the letters, but it didn't come out right. You know what I mean? So I just said microphones. Anyway, it's coming. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's actually good. I got okay. nice. Yeah. Oh, you yeah. Know, I, I try I like to that. I try to keep new stuff coming, yeah. man. You know, mm-hmm. Boogie's Flavor. It's That'd been be two years. Flavor now function. I'm Boogie's nah, Flavor yeah. LLC. Yeah, Look at God. Oh, wonderful. Look at God. Yeah. Flavorful. E I N number. Flavorful. Does number. All that. You dig? I'm legit. You know what I'm talking about? Hey, I appreciate y'all. Every Saturday we do this. um, Every Tuesday and Thursday on Instagram Live at 7 p.m. PST. Um, I got to give a shout out to everybody who watches, everyone who shares, everyone that tags, everyone that comments. I love you all, man, and huh, it's your big homies, big homies. I got to give a shout out to Curtis and Roxanne McNeil. Y'all. They are the truth. If you in Dago and don't know them, I don't know what I don't know what, what what's going on with you. Like you, you know what I mean? Like you don't know them. Like what do you mean you don't know them? You dig? Hey, it's your big. I gotta give a shout out to my camera. Uh, 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 or what's, yeah. what's, what's what? I forget. I keep forgetting the title. Creative director. Creative. Say it again. There you go. Director. Yeah, give it to him. Let, let him tell him. Right what is it? Come on. Creative director. <laughs> and don't forget, creative director. There you go. You dig? <laughs> it's One your time. big homies, big homie Trey Boogie. And we out of here, y'all. One time. Nice. FNG shit. Shot the whole day, go. Shot the bro, Trey Boogie. We slide. Uh, sliding in the rentals, trying to run the milli up In the southeast, Trey Boogie been a plug Rubber bands on the blues, hella panoramic views If you get into it with the squad, you can never lose uh, uh, It's on the flow like Yellow Rider I got your vibe on the toes like nail polish In the city, we get respected from everybody You about to pull up on Trey Boogie, now let's chop it If you talking about the game, let's chop it up If you talking about the hustle, let's chop it up If you talking about the grind, let's chop it up Talking about some fly vibes, baby, let's chop it up If you talking about the game, let's chop it up. If you talking about the hustle, let's chop it up. If you talking about the grind, let's chop it up. Talking about some fly vibes, baby, let's chop it up. Let's chop it up. Got a wet, it's not a cut. Ain't worried about what nobody else got, cause I got enough. Me and Trey Boogie locked in, he threw a lob. I don't hurt to be the sauce it up. Can't nobody go hard as us. If you talking about the game, let's chop it up. If you talking about the hustle, let's chop it up. If you talking about the grind, let's chop it up. Talking about some fly vibes, baby, let's chop it up. If you talking about the game, let's chop it up. Chop it up. If you talking about the hustle, let's chop it up. If you talking about the grind, let's chop it up. Talking about some fly vibes, baby, let's chop it up.